With October finally here, chilly air is on the doorstep as a precursor to the long winter ahead. This chilly air does not only signify the coming season, but also the end of the growing season for farmers all across Pennsylvania. Frost, freeze, or even snow can end the growing season abruptly. To learn more about how the freezing temperatures affect local farmers here in central Pennsylvania, I took a trip just south of State College to right here at Harner Farm. I got to talk to Chris Harner. Harner Farms grows a variety of fruits and vegetables, from sweet corn to apples, peaches, and even pumpkins. Chris mentioned that the later the first frost, the better yield he attains from his crops. So the frost, you know, anything that you plant, you know, this year will be affected by it, other than like cabbage and Brussels sprouts and kale and stuff like that. But uh, any of the tender vegetables, you know, they'll, they'll be done as soon as you get a frost. So when will Harner Farm typically see their first frost or freeze at the end of each year? My guess would be mid-October, you know. I mean, some years we, we haven't had a frost till almost the end of November. Frost isn't the only thing that occurs during the month of October in Pennsylvania. Back in 2011, State College was buried with six inches of snow just before Halloween. You know, all the leaves were still on the trees, and we, we probably got six inches of uh, snow that day. And uh, we were still picking apples at that time. And, uh, you know, we lost a fair amount just because the way the snow pulled them off the trees and everything like that. The first frost that year was just seven days before snow had fallen, creating a rather quick transition from fall into winter. To get more information on what frost and freeze is and when we can expect it across the state, there's no better person to talk to than Kyle Imhoff, the Pennsylvania state climatologist. First one is what is, uh, what is a frost we define as the first date at which you hit 36 degrees Fahrenheit at night. And then our first freeze is when we actually go to the freezing marks of 32 degrees Fahrenheit overnight. The landscape across Pennsylvania causes the first frost or freeze of the season to occur at different times. Early September uh, in the north and west, and as you transition down in the south and east where it's much warmer, it actually is about early November when you first get to uh, that 36 degree mark. So the first freeze is actually about a week or two later, so mid-September for parts of the north and west, and as you go farther south and east, it's closer to mid-November. Freezing temperatures are the preamble to our first snow, which also occurs at different times across the state. So first snowfall uh, is usually around early November um, in parts of the north and west, so Erie, Bradford, those areas, and then it gets closer to mid-December, so just before Christmas uh, near Philly and parts of the south and east. With cooler air on our doorstep, farmers are preparing for the end of the growing season. The precursor to winter will soon be apparent, and our first snowfall may not be far behind. For Weather World, I'm Matt Urasavik.